Hello, I'm here at Graph Expo. My name's James Matthews Paul with PrintingNews.com. Um, and today I'm going to be talking with Tom Boyle, your VP of Sales and Marketing at uh, Heater. Is that right? Correct. Oh, good. I, uh, these facts are right then. Um, so um, you're a Rico customer, and I re understand that you've recently uh, invested in a Rico Pro VC60000, uh, which is high speed continuous inkjet. Is that right? Correct. Um, so tell me a little bit about that platform. You installed it in November. What's it enabling to, you to do as a business and how's it going to take your business on from here? Sure, uh, it was a, a much needed step forward for us. We had invested significantly in the digital cut sheet market and really found that our customers' needs were exceeding those. So now you're looking at adding more and more machines. Uh, and the VC60000 really enabled us to add a significant amount of capacity um, with with one piece of equipment, so it's it's really taken uh, taken our gaming customers and our pharma customers in new directions uh, because of the quality that the machine offers uh, and also the speed uh, in which we can produce the work. What what kind of applications do, would you say have been most affected by uh, by this machine? I would say that uh, people who were traditionally printing something maybe cut sheet and then imprinting. Uh, monochrome single color, uh, moving those products into a full color, full variable environment. So now you're producing a better piece. Uh, and again, along with that, naturally that two-step process costs a little bit more, takes a little bit more time. Now, costing a little bit less and going much faster. In terms of what you're able to offer to your customers, Tom, um, what, what would you say has changed now that you have this machine installed? I would say that the, the nature of a, a machine like this in the process has made the relationship with our customers more consultative uh, because now we're taking a look and reevaluating products that they've kind of done the same way for a long period of time uh, and, and reconfiguring them, trying to make them more valuable to the end user, uh, incorporating a lot of variability, personalization, variable imaging. So it's, it's made the conversation and the relationship much more consultative, much more of a partnership. And uh, you've highlighted a number of really key sales areas there for printers. Where do you see Heaters going next mm -hmm. as a business? Well, I, I, I see us continuing down the path that we've, w that we've taken, uh, and that is working with customers, evaluating their products. Uh, it's also enabled us to get into to, to different lines of business. We're now doing much more retail solutions, which in the past we really weren't able to because of the, the capacity and the quality of the machine. So um, I think that the, uh, there's certainly lots of opportunity there uh, to be a much more valuable solutions provider for our customers you know, versus just a, a, a one-off job printer. And would you say that that's kind of a trend in the market at the moment? That's the way that print service providers are having to be in order to gain business? Yeah, 100%. 100%. I, it, it's much more being an end-to-end -end solutions provider. Uh, customers, there's less, they have more to do, they have less people to do it with, so a vendor that could come in and really kind of show them a solution, give them something that they deal with one person and it's handled start to finish, uh, is really where, where we, as we move forward, it can add a lot of value. And that's a significant pe competitive advantage, right? Absolutely. Tom, can I ask you, how long have you been in the industry? Uh, I've been in the print industry about 25 years. Uh, came from a, a group called Consolidated Graphics and R.R. Donnelly and I've been with the heater for about a year now. And how has the industry changed in that time? What do you think are, are the major differences? <laughs> um, wow, it, 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 is, it, looks, it moves so much faster today. I think the, the good thing with, with digital printing and variability is uh, we have the flexibility now to meet customer needs much more quickly. Uh, jobs are now tracked in, in terms of days and hours, when back in the day it used to be you know, weeks uh, and, and sometimes into months, so it, it's uh, it's more fun, it's much more dynamic, uh, but uh, also it, it's great because you could really be responsive and meet customer needs. And um, obviously, we're here at Graph Expo. Um, it's we're actually here pretty early on day two. It's quite quiet, nice and quiet for now. But mm -hmm. for anyone that's visiting the show or thinking about visiting the show, what would you say that they should be looking for? Well, I, I, they they should they should come with an open mind. Uh, there's lots of new ideas here, lots of new technologies, uh, you know, not only ink on paper, but uh, all kinds of different substrates and formats. So, um, you know, come kind of kind of with, with an open mind uh, to, to look at all the different uh, applications that might be presenting themselves and a lot of the new technology that's being launched. It's, it's truly dynamic and really interesting. 
Tom Ball, thanks so much for joining me at Graph Expo. Uh, thanks for talking to us about Heater, and I wish you all the best uh, with your business and the Ricoh VC 6000. Great, thank you. Thank you.